A smoke extraction and detection system consists of sampling pipes connecting the cargo holes to a smoke detection panel kept in the wheelhouse. Labels on sampling pipe indicate the location from where the smoke is generated. The detection panel consists of nylon propellers inside the glass tubes and a dark chamber with diffused light for each sampling pipe. Suction fans on the Monkey Island continuously draw air from the cargo holds. The nylon propellers continuously whirl as long as the suction fan runs. It indicates that there is no blockage in the sampling pipes. Charts located in the wheelhouse and carbon dioxide room give the information on minimum required cylinders to be released for each hold. In case of fire, suction fans extract the smoke from cargo holds. Detection panel receives the samples of smoke through sampling pipelines and diverting valve. The diffused light illuminates the smoke entering the dark chamber and triggers the alarm. The alarm bells are located on the bridge, engine room and accommodation spaces. A three-way valve located in the wheelhouse isolates sampling line and suction fan. The valve connects the sampling line with the carbon dioxide manifold line. Before operating the carbon dioxide cylinders, all the openings of the cargo hold should be shut. When carbon dioxide gas is released from the cylinders, it flows from the carbon dioxide room to the cargo hold and extinguishes the fire.